After overcoming the consequences of his accident and progressively returning to road cycling competitions, Egan Bernal has begun long training sessions that he classifies as his apocalypses on tough mountain climbs and defying inclement weather. Bernal published a video training under the torrential rain and this prompted an analysis by the Dutch media, in De Leider Struy, where they exposed that the Colombian ran 85 hours and 24 minutes. During November reaching 67 kilometers at 163 watts as his best record, while in the rises reached up to 270 watts. This is what Egan said. I'm not one to tell you this but, if you have a goal, the conditions don't matter, nor how far down or up you are. Fight it. As bad as it goes, you will be calm with yourselves, and that is the most important thing. Regarding December, with figures from Strava, the aforementioned media commented, Bernal has already covered 666.1 kilometers in four days of training this month. Bernal's first Apocalypse Day of 2022, with an incredible distance of 270.22 kilometers, 2,575 altimeters and an impressive average of 38.5 kilometers per hour. Egan Bernal has the Tour de France as his main goal for 2023 and will start the season with the Tour de San Juan in Argentina, before tackling the other European competitions. We all deserve someone to take care of us like my dad did me. My guardian angel on the road. He comes to my house every day when I'm still sleeping to get everything ready for training and leaves in the evening when he leaves the bike washed for the next day, concluded Egan Bernal.